Hello, everybody! Yoda 4 back with GTA Vice City in the last episode. We did anti Polet's missions, the last of our missions, and now we can finally do, finish up the Cuban missions, and hopefully, I'm just saying hopefully that we can get this done real quick. Because uh, this mission isn't really, this upcoming mission's not really that tough, it's just, you have really dumb luck. That's all I gotta say. Because this is not my uh, first attempt. This is my third attempt. But you know what? Screw it. We're gonna get this done. And what is... What the hell happened over here? Whose car is this? Is this my car? Yep. I actually took this car earlier. I was driving around with it. And I jumped out of it because I saw my PCJ600. But you know what? We got our car back from the beginning. So, yeah, It's alright. Oh, the PCJ600 right there. Ah, screw it. So now let's go see Umberto. See what that guy's up to. Oh, this is kind of cool. I always hit that freaking. Oh, well, never mind. This car was fun to drive for the time being. I, whenever I, I always hit a turn right over there. Like, my gosh. Uh, my luck is just awful with that. All right. Umberto's house. Well, uh, I'll take a bus. Give me this bus. I've never, it's, this is my first time driving a bus in this part. Oh my god, this is a good song. And turn the corner, and wide turn, we hit a pole, but you know, we're okay. That's uh, just a little bumper damage, but that's okay. Uh, there's one good thing with the bus, you can actually like ram a lot of people and make it a little bit more fun. What does it say? Does it say whipped on the back? Uh, whip it. Express coach. Anyway, let's go see Umberto Robina. See what he's up to. Hello, officer. The Trojan Voodoo. Sounds like a good name for a mission. Sounds like some kind of... Condom made by Trojan. Hey. I'm kidding now. Oh God. Hey, hey. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm going to make love like a man. You, you see? Know you see? Like this. You don't go up to random people like that. Ah. Oh, hey baby, I wouldn't touch you with a ten foot pole. Humberto Robina, he <laughs> likes the lady, not some goat in a skirt. Oh my God. Tommy, Tommy, I love you. I love you. Let's go. Go where? Can I get a cup of coffee first? No time for coffee. Besides, I just had one. Oh. <laughs> oh. Tell me, how do you take out a snake? You bite him in the ass. <laughs> you go and get us a little car. When you get it, come back and pick up my boy, Pepe. And take them out to such and such. Their processing plant. Okay. Whatever you say, Umberto. Hey, tell me. Tell me. Use their solvent as an explosive. Boom. Bye-bye. Seems like a fun mission. Umberto, what about you? Uh, I'm going to stay behind and watch over that cafe with Papa. He's not feeling so good. You know? I gotta help out, dude. Come on. The last thing I needed was this. Maybe the last thing I needed was an enema, but this comes close. All right. So behind us is Mr. Pepe, and let's take the stallion because we need a vehicle. Okay, hop in back. All right, now we need to find a voodoo because, well, it's gonna help us out, and might as well just might as well go find a voodoo. That's why it's the Trojan horse because we're tricking them. We're gonna use our voodoo to get inside and attack them from the sky. Just kidding. We're gonna attack them from the car. And where's the voodoo? Okay, and oh, oh here's one. Here's one. I got it. All right, dude, let's get out. And let's take this voodoo. Now piss off. Oh, yeah. let's go find oh dude, he's he, he, oh, he just ran away. He didn't even try to get his car. Most of the people try to fight and get their car back, but no, this guy was just off and running. All right, so now we're gonna go meet up with the what? I got a what did I get a warrant for? Um, all right, you know, hey, whatever works. Oh my guys took out. No, no, I'm not lost. <laughs> this place is a dump. He calls uh. He says little Havana's a nice place, and he says little Haiti's a dump, you know. Just to show how much he hates them. Do they really? Oops. <laughs> that pork job is so bad! <laughs> oh, that was such a bad pork job. Oh, well, maybe, uh... Oh, dude, he got ran over. Poor guy. Alright, so anyway, let's head inside here. 
Uh, apparently they drive faster than you, even though I drive like a maniac. But that's okay. Stay in the car until safely parked. Okay, sounds good. Okay, let's listen to some V-Rock, because I can't listen to that. Let's listen to Emotion, why not? This is fitting, right? Oh god, I hit my own guy. Oh jeez, I'm not, I'm not doing a good job. I can't drive in like, an orderly, orderly fashion, like, at all. What's up, dude? Park the car in the blip and get out. Okay. They want to park right here? Oh, I just like went around Pepe. Uh, what you want to do is I highly recommend telling you, um, there are stairs over here. Get up these stairs immediately. Plant this bomb because this bomb will take the most time to um, uh, get to and detonate. So, you got 45 seconds to plant the rest of the bombs. There's one over here. Plant this one. Get the hell out of here. There's, an there's another one right over near the entrance if you want to get that one first. All right, we got 30 seconds to get the hell out of here, so clear the factory. You're probably wondering, where do we go? Well, you actually go over here, a little secret way, uh, and just watch what happens. Boom, explosion, yeah! Jeez, that is nice. Oh my god. What, whoa, oh my god, we are savages. Oh my god! Some guy lived? Mission complete? 10,000 big ones! And now we're done with Umberto Robina's mission. And you can see, right over there, what we did. We did a shit ton of damage. Hop. Nice. So now, we are now done with Ro Umberto Robina's missions. I actually tend to have bad luck with that because I... Oh, we got a phone call. Hello? Said that to me since I left jail. <laughs> See you around. Oh my god. Oh now now that now that you did that, the Haitians will shoot you anytime you enter enter little Haiti. So that's a little uh, little heads up, be careful. And also I'm wearing uh Cuban clothing, which is something I shouldn't really do. I should just change my outfit. And sure I'll God give me a car, they're right there. Alright, deuces, I am in the Manana. And, okay, maybe they don't chase after you. Maybe if you just walk in the street, they'll chase after you, but that's how it goes. Um, so, yeah, this part was rather productive. Um, I might actually just head over to the east side of Vice City because, well, all the missions we have are there is just Kent Paul. That's it. All we have is Kent Paul's missions, and Kent Paul, you know how he is. He's, he's Mr. Kent Paul. I feel like Kent Paul is a reference to, like, some British people's names, like, like Paul McCartney for Paul. And I don't know what the first name Kent is. It's, a uh, I don't know, it's, uh, I'm just curious. But anyway, um, what have you guys been up to lately? I'm sorry I haven't really been posting a lot of Vice City. I've been posting majority, mostly Twilight Princess because I'm really trying to get into that game, trying to beat that game because I've never played that game before. And I'm glad I get to play this game because, oh my god, I had a hellish time playing Twilight Princess last night because, well, I just had really bad luck. That's all I can say is I had really bad luck. And hopefully, you know, killing some people will... Help me play better. And I, and I needed a little break from it anyway because I played it way too much. Not that there's anything wrong with that, it's just I played it a little too much. But um, I record it too much, there you go. And also, some good news, I actually uh, finished one of my college classes today. So, that's one college class down. I I think I did, I think I got a B in that class. I'll take it. And uh, I have my last class tonight around 5.30 and I'm pretty sure I'm guaranteed an A or a B in that class. An A or a B plus or something, because I know I did fucking awesome in that class. And I'm gonna find the place where I can get nice clothing because I want to change out of these uh, Cuban outfits because I don't want to wear them anymore. Like I don't, I want to wear them. Give me some nice clothing. Go oh, sorry about your infernus, dude. I was in the wrong lane. That was your fault. Uh, but um, where are we? Where, where, wait, is that it back there? No, that's definitely not it back there, is it? No, it's. No, it's not. Okay. My bad, my bad, my bad. Acc accidents happen every day. And there's money back there, so I could have just picked up that money, but oh well. Um, 
Damn it, where do I get that fucking clothes? I don't remember it at all. This is this is pretty bad. Um I had problems with this last time. Look at me go. Alright, turn and I believe it's down one of these roads, I guess. So um how do you guys like this let's play so far? I think I'm doing a rather good job with it. I know they say this about almost every part, but it's true. I mean, I'm getting a lot more feedback from this Let's Play than my most recent Let's Plays. Um, Twilight Princess, I'm getting a lot of feedback from it, and I'm also getting a lot of feedback from, um... Oh, here we go. I get a lot of feedback from Twilight Princess and Vice City, which I really like because... You know, it's, it's good that I'm getting a lot of feedback. I really enjoy it. And what do we got here? We got ourselves a Hermes, isn't it? Hermes. I don't like the Hermes... The Hermes is a pretty crappy vehicle. I don't like it. The turning is bad. The look of the car just has that old look to it. it. Doesn't even look like 80s cars. It looks like a fucking 50s or 50s car. Yeah. So we'll go get the, our body armor and then we'll end the part there. So. Uh, yeah. I definitely will post a little bit more today because well I have a break between classes. And you know why not record? I haven't recorded a lot of Vice City lately, so might as well do it. And we get to finish the freaking godforsaken Cuban and Haitian side quest. I freaking hate that so much. And uh, that's about it. So, in the next part of GTA Vice City, we will do Kent Paul's mission right over there at the, um, right over there at the lovely Malibu Club. So, if you guys like the video, you guys can subscribe, leave a comment. I'll see you guys next time. I'll see you guys then.